Hello Dudu Artist, it is I, Abdul Fami. Welcome back to Abdul Strong Studio. Last time on Season 2 of the Ice Age, where we're joined Direwolves for Episode 3. But now, we're on Season 1 for this next episode of Bison. Let's get started with the lesson. And here are the drawings of the looks of Bison. And the way how we describe them, they have small horns on their heads. And they have small hairy beard on their chins. And they have a hairy back. And here's a drawing as a sketch of the bison walking through the grassland with the herd or the meadow. If you like this drawing, make sure you give this a like. Let's get started with the drawing. So let's get started with the head. And the way how we're going to draw the head is we're going to make it like a twisted egg. And now we're going to draw the back with the neck as we're going to make a wave. We're just going to raise that and redraw the head. And then you want to continue drawing the neck and leaving this for the leg. And now you're going to create the the back, which is the back side. And going to start creating the legs. And the leg is, is doesn't have to be that big, and it's not supposed to be actually. You just have to make sure. The leg is more hairy. So let's give this leg more hair. And then you can start creating the bottom. And then you're going to start creating the other leg. And you're going to continue giving hair. We're going to make sure the legs are a bit more separated. And now we're going to draw the front leg. We're going to give it more here. Make sure this bison has hair. Much hair, much less hair of the leg. And then we're going to draw this last leg. The bison's right one.
making sure is make sure the leg is not too big and now we're going to start drawing here at the back And now we're going to start drawing a lot here around the back. I'm trying to make this more perfect. <laughs> and make sure it doesn't become more fat. Even though buffaloes are kind of fat, not that fat. And now we're going to draw the horns. And now we're going to give him a mouth. <laughs> we're going to try to make the neck more big. We're going to draw him an eye. And now we're going to give him a nose. And some small beard. Technically, we're going to make them a bit small because a bison's horn was supposed to be not too big. Giving hair on the head. And now we're going to draw the ground. We're going to start trying to create grass. Oh, I forgot. We're supposed to make him a tail. Every bison has a tail. And now we're continuing the grass. Oh wait, I also supposed to draw the hooves. And we're going to try to fix the nose, since this does kind of look funny. But I'm not done yet! And now... <laughs> Make sure this is a bit clean. And now it looks like a bison. 
we're going to draw the hair later. Right now, we're going to just continue drawing the glass. Just so you know, the way how you can draw grass or making long grass instead of trying to do whatever we do to create grass, you just draw with your pencil going up and down, like making wave lines as you go anywhere you wanted to stop. And now we're going to give it clouds so we can make this like it's real life. Not real life, like to have more detail. And now we're going to start shading the bison. Now for the bison's back, you want to make sure the back of it is darker. It has hair, but it is darker than his body. Many others could be dark. But his back is also kind of like in color, the bison's back is usually supposed to be like dark brown. Well, maybe not dark brown, not all the time. <laughs> but some, yes. <laughs> and now we're going to give hair for the bison. The other back. And make sure your drawing doesn't have any dirty lines or mess up stuff. And now we're going to shave the head. And we're going to make this more darker. And now we're going to give the legs more hair. We're going to give them more hair and we're going to shave the hoofs.
We're just going to make sure we shave the the legs. So we got this more dark. We go and give him more hair. More shading to the belly. And now we're going to shade and give more hair to the other leg. And because this is the darker back, we're going to make sure we make give it a straight hair to try to make the back complete. We just shave the tail, and now we're going to shave the grass. And we're also going to shave the clouds. And we're going to draw the clouds just a bit so we can see where the what the clouds look like. We're going to erase it a bit because I might have added too much hair. Just like that. And now we're going to draw more grass and try to hide the legs. Well, he won't hide forever. We're just trying to make him stand in grass around him. Shave more, and we're going to shave the, a little shave the horns.
we're just going to fix that. And there he is, the Jeweled Shaded Bison. Since now we are done, let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about this Jeweled Bison we just come through. And now before we start ending this video, let me show you guys the art picture. And here is the artwork and colored picture where there are bisons eating at the middle. I would like to say I am proud of this artwork because this is like the first time making a perfection and beautiful artwork before. And that's it. Well, that's it for episode 9. Be free to do your own drawings and thanks for watching. And if you like this video, make sure you give it a like button, make sure you subscribe, and remember, I'll see you next time with your own good amazing and fantastic good art.